Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Indie Brew, the only show on the internet dedicated to two of mankind's finest achievements, drinking and gaming. So today we're looking at Regalia Alpha, a game made for the Game Jolt Glitch Jam that I found. It looks pretty interesting. I'll give a rundown when we actually get to the game, kind of deviating from the norm, as it were. And we are also going to be looking at Schilling, which is from the Odell Brewing Company. It is a wheat beer. And it comes in at 5.3 alcohol percent by volume. I should just start saying APV. ABV. Don't know why I don't. So, we're just gonna get our pour here. That does not look like a Hefeweizen. That looks very much like a Pilsner, but it's got a fantastic head. Pause for sexual innuendo. That actually really does not look what I was like I was expecting. I tried to say Zahn from these guys, which I did on a stream. Um, I'll have a link in the description if you guys want to see that, but I'll probably go back to it because I actually really enjoyed it. Uh, but we'll get a drink here. It smells like beer. <laughs> you can't go wrong with beer. So we will be right back. Okay, so we are here, as you can see. I'm going to read off the opening because I actually think the premise of this game is, is quite interesting, and I'll, I'll get into why that is here as we start playing. So, made for the glitch game and RPG contest, together Regalia Alpha is a hack and slash RPG simulator with a huge twist. Your character, which you spent a lot of time creating, levels down and loses skill abilities, skills and abilities, it's just a... Uh, as you fight due to a glitch, which you, along with your virtual friends who can't log out of the game world, must now uncover and fix before your time runs out. So, we will get into the gaming. And it looks like there's only one character, and I am going to reset data just in case we decided, you know, tests and all that. So, D-pad to control your character and move about. I really like the art style. Uh, it, it definitely has an anime feel, and I say an anime feel because this is actually a, a, a storyline that reminds me of, and if you're um, familiar with this, Dot Hack, which was a manga and anime super, and video game actually, uh, super series. Um, a, a few years back, and I, I, I don't know if there's, they've continued the story, but it, it features an online world where people can't log out and go into a comatose state in, in the real world, and I, I think that's uh, quite interesting. So my first complaint, and I, I hate to start with a complaint, as you know, I, I, I try to be as positive as possible, especially with games that are perhaps not uh, complete, which, although they, they said they were, this was complete and they wanted to add more features to it and make it into... A, a wider game, which I would, so far I, I'm impressed, I like what I see, I like the, really like the music, um, I'd actually like to see that, um, the, the controls for jump, for wall jumping are kind of, I don't know, finicky, and not in a good way, not like skill preci precision finicky, like, sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't work, so, um, that's my first comment about the game. So we're just gonna go. I do like the loading. I re it really does feel like we're kind of in an MMO. Um, we do have an attack, and there's actually a combo to do, which you, which is actually really cool. We do seem to have like a, um, a fatigue bar, and obviously these guys are glitching out. Dude, you're finally online. Something's gone horribly wrong. That's Stranger X. And we'll get the storyline. Oi, reply, which we, we can't, so... Um, here, let me move my, sorry, my cursor. His chat box is probably done for, like our movement. Eh. Beast Mage 93. Why is the game shown in a tutorial? Damn, we can't move, we can't log out, we can't even shut this down. Brain dead. check whether you can at least move and attack. So, this was, uh, X-Ponies. Why rent you guys Malin customer support? Idiot, we already did, they have no idea what's happening. And we can't and can't get us out. It's some weird glitch with the game, which expanded to our comps as well. So here's our attacks, which you already saw, and we will move here, and uh, we will use our ability, which I don't actually know what that does. And it see the, the random ability seems to have changed. Because when I tried this out originally, it was a dash. Be careful, though. We don't know how this may have affected you. You go, Brainy. So we are going to go and see what we can do. So I really like the level design, I really like the, the level art, and and the jumping doesn't seem, and this doesn't seem breakable. So we can do YY and 
Okay, so that gives us a pretty good uh, combination of abilities, and that looks like an enemy down there, so... What is that? So, yeah, that is to that is totally an enemy. Oh, okay. Quite a f quite a few. Oh, don't don't get hit. We don't seem to be losing health. Which is weird. And oh, okay, so we have a heal. Okay, the 100 is our level. Okay, the green bar is our health. Okay. And this doesn't seem to Oh, it does damage and we can't actually hit it. Yeah, okay. So, let's go on. Controls are pretty responsive, other other than... Ooh, nice music. Oh. Let's not, uh, let's not die. Let's actually show some, a uh, small level of comp competence while we, while we play for a change. Um, and these weird... bunny rabbit things, I'm not exactly sure. And, oh, we actually see our experience going down. Um, uh, hey bud. Yeah. Just a warning, because this happened to me. As you can see, I'm reading. You may start losing your most used attacks and abilities as you level down. So be careful and choose which attacks to use wisely. Oh, that's terrible. Oh. Well, that's no good. That's, uh, it, that's, that's what attracted me to this game, though. I really like that idea that we're, we're de-leveling. Um... It, I just think it's a neat concept, and I, I like, um, okay. Maybe we can go this way? Sure can. What happens if we use our abilities, um, so be careful and choose, also apparently you need to kill all enemies to use the portals, okay. Makes sense. Really like the music. Ooh, Jesus, okay. Oh, wow. There's a lot of guys, and they are hitting us for a lot of damage. I would hate to lose my healing. And I'm, I'm afraid that we're going to lose our, our fireball attack here, which I really like. The, the attacks look cool. The attack animations look really cool. I'd like to see what the other characters can do. So I, th I, I think that that would, you know, give a, a really cool, like, branching storyline. I'd really like, to, you know, to explore this storyline. I just... This, this is a concept that's near and dear to my heart. I used to play MMOs as a, as a kid. Kid, quote-unquote. Um, and I, I don't know, I have a soft spot for games that try to emulate that and the social aspect. Oh, we leveled down by two. That's a little scary. And we can't jump while we're attacking. And I think that's, you know, pretty, pretty self-explanatory. So once we get into that combo state, the physical attack seems pretty strong. Oh, there are still enemies. So once we get to the next, um... I bet you I know where they are. Probably up there. Once we get to the next, uh... No, okay. Where are the other enemies? Come on, game. Don't tell me I got stuck. That would, that would be... Oh, we can actually... We can go back, okay. Interesting. Oh no! Oh no, this isn't back! This is totally not back! This is to a totally new place that I've never seen. Oh! Oh, it's you who's shooting lightning at me. So I, I should take my drink, because I, I said I would. You're a... Oh, pain in the butt! And those weird... things there. I would like to see a boss. I imagine there are bosses as we progress through here, and there might even be more than one boss, which would actually be really cool. Okay, so we've still got more enemies. Okay, not the way we want to go. There are definitely more enemies up here. And it's it's stuff like, like this, where it's like, okay, we obviously have to, to jump. And it's it's just, it's very, it's very difficult to do that. Um, and it, it kind of does impact how you play the game, because it's like, I can't jump, I can't really beat the game, um, and maybe that's part of, that just is supposed to be part of the glitchiness, but I, I suspect that it's perhaps not, so, okay, um, nope, still more enemies, 
we, we still we can't seem to hit this thing, so I'm guessing that that's just not an enemy. Where are the other enemies? Oh, they're okay. So different portals open up to different areas. Okay, it's getting getting the hang of it. Like I said, I only did a, a preliminary test, so um, not not a hundred. Ooh, he's glitching through the the floor there. Which we can't really... Oh, there he goes. Okay. I just wanted you to come and join us. Let's drink our beer. And it doesn't taste like I have either. Um... I'm not getting a lot of wheat flavor. I mean, it is a wheat beer. Um, let's see. Dude, my arrow keys aren't working. That's our movement keys. You must be new here, it's all stuck for us, and welcome to hell, where you can't even log out. How can this brain dead guy move? I guess our name is Brain Dead. These were magical. We followed order chat, he is the only guy in the whole game who can now The uh the lead speak and the regu the in the talking could could probably go if if I'm being completely honest. Alright, they don't have anything else to add, so. That's just my personal preference. I'm not a big fan of Leap Speak. I wasn't even when I gamed. So. Makes it hard to read and get your, uh, your ideas across. So, I, I'm, I'm not a personal fan, but I understand limited, limited space. So. And as I play more, I'm getting, uh, controls down a little bit better, and the, the jumping is becoming a little bit easier. I would still say it's it's not ideal, but if that's the only criticism you can level at a game, then it's pretty sure. Ooh, new new setting. I really like the design for levels. I really do. The, the, the repetition of enemies is a little unfortunate. Maybe if they expand this game, maybe just do more than palette swapping. Obviously, it's made for a game jam, so you only have so much time to, to do that and, and so many resources to, to do that, but... This definitely feels like we're gonna have an end boss, right? Or a boss. We're in a castle with a lot of, of enemies, um, and that's pretty awesome. Hopefully we can we can heal here. Oh, they gave us a little bit of health. Oh, there is more enemies. Oh, up here. Okay, cool. So different portals are closed. Oh, hey, you have lost powers. Mega Man. Oh, we got new powers. Before I get stuck here, I saw an NPC that shouldn't have been here. This is definitely... Oh, he actually looks like a little bit like Zero. That's cool! Trust me, I've played this area a lot of times. The King NPC should have been here. What's weird is that there's no single NPC anywhere. I don't even know... I don't know what happened here, but they all went the way you came. So go back and try out the other castle. This tastes a lot like their Saison. Um... This beer. There's a bit of a... Oh, hey, totally. Totally. Oh, added more stuff. I really like this wind attack. I really like that animation. It's really neat. And it has a really nice area of area of effect, too. And I, I just like the idea that we're leveling down. I don't feel any less powerful. I don't feel like I'm losing health. Uh, and th maybe that would be a good way to do it. But yeah, the, the beer's okay. The, the Odell Company, I don't know. They All their beers kind of taste the same. The only difference is that the... The wheat beer is just a little less sour than the Saison. The Saison had a, a nice... I'm trying to think of a good term for that. It, it had a, 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 a... Almost pungent flavor to it. This one is just a very beery kind of flavor to it. And I, I like it. I, I don't think I would... I don't think I'd buy it again, though. I think there are just... There are better wheat beers out there. So if you're a fan of wheat beers... This is not a, a, you know, it's, it's just, it's, it's a wheat beer. That's all it is. And I don't know if we're going to be able to beat this in a full episode, but I'm going to, well, I guess we'll see how far we get. 
they're doing pretty good damage for having leveled down. Is this the one? Nope, okay. Oh, crap! Okay, enemies galore. Dude, their new traps popping up everywhere. He probably can't chat. I cannot. Um, and our, our um, healing is gone, unfortunately, so that's a bit of a bummer. I really do like being able to heal. Okay. But we do have our our lightning. Oh, level down. Continuing to do that. Let's see if we can't find our way out. There we go. And again, I really like the jams. And and if you've watched my show for any length of time, you'll know that music is is definitely one of the major aspects of my game reviewing. And and this is really good. It definitely feels I you know, it feels like an old SNES beat 'em up game a little bit, and maybe that's what they're going for. But I, I like it. I'm I'm actually a, a big fan of this, and I'd like to see it increase. More enemy design, like I said. Maybe some some smoother controls would not be out of place. But other than that, I, I think what they've got here is 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 pretty bang up, to be frank. Um, no enemies there. Enemies up here. Yep, tons of enemies. Tons, plenty. And it's nice that they're giving us more healing along the way. That That is a nice touch. Because they don't need to do that, necessarily. Let's see if this is the right way. Sure is. Although, I must say, hey, go back to where you started is a little frustrating. Um, especially considering we're getting weaker and weaker as we go. So that's kind of like a battle of attrition thing going on here, but that's... The, the attack sound effects for this weird thing is, is pretty interesting. I would like to see, like, a, a block ability or something like that, maybe? I don't know if there is one, but it doesn't seem like there is. This has pretty decent range, but as as we continue... And, I, and that really... Having a, a differentiation of what is and isn't something that you can slide on would also be pretty appreciated. I think that's my other, only other criticism so far. I'm, I'm kind of doing this in media, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, I, I, it's why, why can't we slide on that wall, but we can slide on on all the others? Um, seems a little arbitrary to me, if you ask me. So, and not quite clear. And again, I really do like how they're giving us a little bit more health because we we you know obviously need it, and we should probably use our <laughs> melee attack a little bit more. Those bunny things, man, are a pain. I don't, I don't know how long this is, on, um, but if we get to a boss, I'll probably end it end it there. But I, like I said, I like what I see. I, th I think for a game jam, this is done very, very competently. The, the sprite work is really well done, despite having a lot of the same enemies over and over and over again. Even even having giving them a couple extra like, or different attacks would be nice. And that's just, you know, how I feel. And, and you know, post-mortem on the beer, because I don't really feel like there's anything else to talk about. It's hoppy, it's malty, it's it's beer. There's nothing standing out against it. There's no reason for me to ever buy it again. Um, and that is a, is a unfortunate, because the, the artwork is actually really good. Actually, the, the artwork on the bottle is, is phenomenal. Oh, God, these things are... Oh! We, we actually got stuck for a second. That was cool. There we go. So we are heading back, obviously, as you can see. Oh, you are enemies, and you're not supposed to be here. There we go. I'd like to see a boss. Ponies? Anybody? Oh, you're back. You can talk. Normal. Drainy's back. Hooray! Wait, he texted me. Apparently all NPCs and generic enemies are gone. Okay. Specific enemies are popping out of place to attack him. If he couldn't text you, why the hell didn't he do it be If he could text you, why the hell didn't he do it before? My bad, I'll type everything here to let the other guild members know. And he's been losing AXP in his level every time he fights. Yep, that's very true. No! Damn it, you don't have much time, then. Move. Says he was told to check out the other 
out the cat the castle of time. Good luck, Brainy. I don't know why we're called uh, Brainy, but you have lost powers. Oh, we do actually have a, a guard. Good, 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 good. Very nice. That is is very helpful. I must say, we are just, um... Oh, and it stays as long as we have our, uh, power bar. Very nice. But the, the power loss seems arbitrary, because we didn't really use the dash that much. We'll finish our beer, because... We're adults, and you always finish your beer. Anyone owes one... Oh look, it's the player who can move. Really? Is that gonna be the title that you give me? Please don't take my lightning blade away! Being able to move would also be kind of nice in these attacks. Oh, we lost level. Whoa, he... so he's not a rumor. He's kind of cute too, you and your virtual fetishes. Okay. I mean, I've, I definitely met people like that when I was playing online games. Oh, we died. Okay, so when we die, it just brings us back. That's good. Okay. Brings us back at half health, which doesn't seem all that helpful, but... And it, they still can damage us, apparently. There we go. Yeah, we lost some... I want this health. Thank you. So now, now it's kind of becoming a struggle about keeping health... And, and continuing to fight while we continue to the sleep decrease. And I, I, again, I really like this concept. I think it's a really neat concept. And I, I actually really enjoy this game. Um, I would, like I said, I would like to see it as it goes longer. I think that'd be really awesome. It, does, it was looking like we weren't even being able to do damage to him. And that was a little... Ooh, so many traps. The, the traps seem to just do damage to you arbitrarily, and I don't really like that. Like, you move through them, and then they shoot you. And I'm, I'm not... A, I don't know how I feel necessarily about, about that. There just doesn't seem to be a whole lot of things you can do with, with you know, health. You can you can jump and kind of dodge, but you're, you're gonna get hit eventually. Um, but tanking, it doesn't seem to necessarily be doing, doing the best, especially against these guys, because they are ranged, and it's actually kind of hard to dodge their their attacks. But that's cool. Um, is, you know, obviously... They shouldn't be. Um, is there still enemies? Oh, there they are. Okay. These weird... weird bunnies are frustrating. But the, and the enemies don't seem to be doing any more damage as we, we decrease in level, which is actually something that I'd like to see. Although, maybe that would make the game a little too hard, but it makes sense that these enemies would do less damage. So, and they, they are sending them in, in larger and or s different batches, too, which is, is kind of nice. So we are at the next castle, which has plenty of health. Probably shouldn't have taken both, but uh, if we die, obviously, we'll uh, we'll be able to, to deal with that. Oh, it does actually seem like we're starting to lose a little bit more health. And this this wind attack, man, is is pretty pretty nice for clearing enemies out around us. We should really not have taken that second health. Um, and there are tons of enemies up there too. So if we die, at least we'll we'll know what to do. Yeah, those trap things really aren't explained very well, and you can't interact with them. Uh, and that's yeah, we're gonna die. Yeah, we're totally gonna die. This doesn't actually seem to do any... That doesn't seem to block damage, as it were. So, um, we'll, we'll reserve some of that. And that stupid... The, the traps do so much damage. It's the traps that are actually the, the difficult part now. And that's the... Good. I like it. It, it definitely meshes well with the idea of us, of us getting weaker. And I, I, I enjoy that aspect of this whole experience. So this, this has been a fun game. I, I was just looking for things to do for, for Indie Brew, because I'd, I'd like to do do more of these as, as time goes on, and I saw this on the front page of, really, of the game Jolt, and I really liked it. So if we can't beat it, beat this this time, then we'll probably end the episode. Um, oddly enough, drinking does not help this game. <laughs>
said no one ever, or hopefully. Um, well, that's not true. Maybe there there are definitely some games that that uh, you shouldn't be drinking with. Super Hexagon seems to be seems to. Um, yeah. We actually got stuck there. I don't know, don't know if that's intended or or what, but obviously there's there's a glitch going on, and it's hard to tell if that's intended or not. And, but I really do like the idea that we're leveling down and we're slowly just getting weaker. Um, I I don't know. I just it it really appealed to me. Um. Oh, are there more? Yep, totally. Totally more enemies, and that's actually really scary because we're gonna die. Let me guess. Yep. Okay. Okay. We'll we'll be smart about this because we have ah shit. God damn it! I know I said we we're gonna we we're gonna go, but I I feel like we maybe should should clear this out first. That way we have a better chance. We'll, we'll give it one more shot. I I know this episode's gone on quite quite long. Comparatively to other episodes, or at least it definitely feels like we've 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 done a lot in a, in a short amount of time. I really like this game; it's very addictive. I really suggest going and trying this out for yourself. Okay. Can we spawn these guys first? Yes, we can. There we go. So just being a little bit smarter. I, I was afraid that we had we had lost we had missed some enemies. Okay. This is probably how they were they intended us to progress. Which makes sense now that we're we're here and it all kind of meshes together. Unfortunately, I can't put this in non full screen so I can't really see myself in the the face cam. I really hate these these bunnies, especially because we we really we, once you're in an attack, you're locked in position and that is a little little frustrating. And those traps, man, are really annoying. So we're going to go and, and get our heal on, which, you know, we did on purpose, really. As soon as we came down, it did damage to us. I really dislike those traps. The music, again, is, is really good. Moon Ranger. Brain. Or is that... that was... I saw an NPC this way follow it. And yeah, I know you can't reply. Won't mind. Okay, let's try to get them all in one area so that we can just kind of hit them. I thought we... Oh, we didn't actually use the heal. And we probably should, because I don't want to die. So obviously the NPC is is the source of this, this bug. That's where it seems to be leading us. But I, I really like it. There's a bit of a mystery. If, if the, the storyline was expanded, I, I could really see this going for a full-length game. And I like that. Okay, let's hit them as hard as we can. I've been reserving the lightning blade for as long as possible. Because I, I didn't want to lose it. Um, and it actually looks like it's getting harder to hit things. So let's see where this leads us. Oh, totally feels like a boss. Really? Not boss yet? Okay. I really want to see the boss. I want to see what they did with, the, with that. I think that'll be really interesting to see. And this is so... This is really good... Eat your heart out, Rogue Legacy. This is how you make a, a suspenseful and impactful game. And this is just for a game jam. <laughs> take, take that fully fleshed out game that, I, that may not seem like it has anything to do with anything. Okay. More enemies, of course. That thing died pretty quickly. The, the traps I would like to see maybe more variety too, because these things are really just annoying. And that one seems larger. Le another level down. I like how it gives us a, a, a sound as if we're leveling up, because it makes you like, oh, oh, hey. Okay. Well, you're finally here. Sawsome. I've been stuck in this place for so long. This is awesome. And there's this fat guy flying. You're talking about me? The fat guy. Holy shit, you're an NPC. How are you talking? I'm no mere NPC, my dear. And 
I was I I was here waiting for brain dead. This is some weird game feature. I'm no feature either. You see, like brain dead here is the player who can move. I'm the NPC who can chat. Really? Yes, I'm a self-aware NPC. Well, that's no good. I'm the cause of this glitch. Yep. I'm the reason you can't see any other NPCs, and we don't have actually have any abilities. Rallying them up, the revolution has started. Oh no! Your king has fallen. No one respected me when I was a normal NPC. Yeah, I can understand that. Sell me this, sell me that. Why would I? I'm the master of my own destiny. And I've been waiting for you, brain dead, to lose your powers before fighting me because I know all of them. I now own all of them. Wait, so you steal powers? How come you're flying? No in-game power can make you fly. No, that's because of the Red Bull can I had lying around. Oh, good humor. I like it. So brain dude won't tell me you're going to fight this guy in your level with no powers. This game is done for. Enough chat. Oh, shit. Let me guess. We wall hang until he does it like a charge attack? No? I can't do anything. Oh, crap, that hurts. <laughs> cool fight! <laughs> can't do anything! Okay. Okay, so definitely need to just hang on the walls. That seems to be the answer here. And he's... Oh, can I bop on his head? Oh, I can bop on his head! Okay, I understand now. I see how we have to fight him. So it's like it's like Mario! Go oh, going back to our roots! Okay, so it, the, uh, the hitbox is a little... screwed up, but... Very cool! I, I like this. It, it's a subversion. There's a bit of humor to it, too. Um... Okay. I'd like to see him move faster while he's doing this. We need to be careful about our health. Okay. Yeah, the, the hitbox is a little strange. Is you had to be like right on top of his head, or is it the wings that we have to hit? Is that why I'm I'm not? Yeah. Okay. It looks like we just have to like hit the wings. Ouch. That's a lot of damage. Oh shit, we're gonna die on our first try, but we'll definitely give this another shot. Oh fuck. Yeah, this actually really makes the the fact that our, our wall jump is is kind of garbage a problem. So much health. A health bar wouldn't be remiss. Um so we'll wait until we need that health. Yeah, okay, it's the wing. I like his frying pan. And I know I, I switched in my area and I see, sorry. Maybe each wing has a different health bar. I like how we phase through them. Yeah, that... The controls for sticking to walls is, is just not my favorite thing. It's really making this fight uh, a bit frustrating. Me. Otherwise, otherwise, I'd hide. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Otherwise, I feel that this would actually be uh, not that difficult. And now we're having. Oh, really? Come on. Uh, like I said, a health bar. Yeah, we're not even hitting him anymore. There we go. Okay, so it is the top of his head. That would explain why we're not hitting him. But you have to get like right at the top. That that hitbox is. Super, super, super small. But I want to be able to beat a game for once on... It's really... It is really frustrating, I'm sorry. Okay. 
Come on now. Yeah, it's it's so weird. It's like we can hit him in like Maybe he has to be near the wall to hit him. Okay, that's That's what it is. Oh, maybe we're supposed to like slide on slide down on him. I don't know. It's weird. Cuz none of the none of the is working and that's like I said, very Okay, annoying. See, we can do it there. Come on now. How much health do you ha honestly have? No indication that he's losing any health either. Ouch. He does so much damage. Come on, come on. There we go. Thank goodness. Ooh, nice little music. Ruffle, that was hilarious. It was hilarious. So what now? I'm still stuck. You look like you're coming back. Saying you can't reply either, since you haven't. I can't. Okay. And that's the end. As always, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Indie Brew. Thanks for watching. <laughs>